Welcome back, folks. This is Mr. O here. We're going to continue the walkthrough for The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD for the Switch. This is part 15, and we are now deep in the Lanairu Desert. Let's move on after the title screen, of course. Cue the title screen. Now, where was I? I could have sworn there was a chest here. Oh well. Let's see about... Yeah, I think it's time we took out the old beetle and did some reconnaissance. Let's go ahead and do some reconnaissance now. Along with dive bombing. Yeah, a certain object. Now, if memory serves me correctly, there should be a time shift stone in that big mountain over there. Oh, okay, there's a time shift stone over there. First, let's activate that. Man, this has definitely got to be a century ago because that bridge must have collapsed over time. So. What Fi is saying is... Yeah... Yeah, those bacoblins. <laughs> I was just scanning that bacoblin. You see, whenever you see a skull there, there's usually... That usually indicates that there is a deceased bacoblin there. I'm, I mean, a techno bacoblin, anyway. Yeah. These guys... Oh yeah, got to avoid these like the Black Plague. Ah, you see what I mean? Yeah. Try to strike them while they're defending themselves with their uh, with their taser bats. Oh, <laughs> oh man, that never gets old. The old uh, goofy yell that is. <laughs> yeah. Now. I think it's time at this point. Let's do a bit of reconnaissance while carrying a bomb. Yeah, a bit of reconnaissance goes a long way, especially with the hook beetle. Bombs away! Did I miss? Oh, goofy, I missed. Let's give that another go. Actually, you know what? Let's collect those rupees from that spire while we're at it. Mine. Now, wasn't there another rupee on this side? I could have swore there was. If, unless memory doesn't serve me correctly. Okay, I think there's one up there. I could be wrong, though. you got to correct me if I'm wrong. Oh, there's a rupee. As a matter of fact, there should be one at the top of the spire here. Top of the rim. Now, there is definitely a time shift stone down there in that mountain, so let's get ourselves into position. Aim well. Grab the bomb. Gain a little bit of altitude. And let's see. I hope I get that. Oh, there's another rupee there. Bombs away! That's one hell of a way to play basketball. Oh, those trees definitely weren't there before. Yeah, actually they were in the original, but you get the idea. Those trees... Yeah. Oh. Oh, I forgot about that bar. I forgot about there was a switch there, too. Okay. It takes me a while to remember that. I mean, like I said, I haven't played this in a long time. Let alone the original version. Okay. I could do the Skyward Strike here. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I should definitely... Yeah, I think I'm going to use the Slingshot. Get the Slingshot at the ready. Or we can Skyward Strike that switch there to open that gate. 
Okay. That's done it. Good. Now, let's get off. This is where we get off. Okie dokie. There should be more. Oh. Are those like Deku scrubs in the desert? They're actually called rock, but they're actually called rock off the rocks. I mean, you would think they'd be called Deku scrubs, but I think they're like the evil evolved versions of the Deku scrub. I mean, they sure spit rocks like Deku scrubs. I mean, actually, Deku scrubs don't spit rocks. They spit acorns. Yeah, those are Octoroks for sure. I mean, if you think about it, Octoroks and Deku scrubs are basically the same. I mean, it, I mean, except for what they spit out of their mouth to attack you. And what's this guy doing here? What's he doing here? Yeah. Okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, Zelda is definitely on the other side of this blockade here. We can't really do much about it from here. Even the bombs won't do any damage there. Now there is a skull there, so that means there's a techno bacoblin there. And there's a cactus with a bomb on top. Looks like we gotta get out the old hook beetle. Now there should be a time shift stone up there somewhere. And I missed the bomb. Yeah. I tell you, these motion controls can be a real pain sometimes. Bombs away! Oh, let's get that rupee. Never have enough rupees. Can never have enough rupees there. Now, now what I'm gonna do... Yeah, there's definitely a time shift stone under this pile of rubble here. Yeah! Oh, man. We... Yeah, okay. Okay, time to hit the time shift stone and get the time shift. And cause a major time shift over here. But in doing so, we awoke the uh, cart. But we also awoke the robot and the techno. And the techno in here. Okay, time to take the shit out of them. Oh. <laughs> I just pushed him right through time! He's a dead motherfucker. Yep. He's a dead motherfucker. Oh, first we gotta talk to that robot. I thought I just completely broke the game. <laughs> but, looks like that's not the case. Anyway, we've got... We've got a new area on the map, and he's going to upgrade it for us. Sweet. Yeah, he definitely upped our map for us. So, that's cool. Now that we... Now that... Now that he's upgraded our map... And, of course, Fi is going to let us know the same thing that I'm going to let you know. The accuracy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That. Um. There should be another time shift stone here. Let's hit that. I could have just used my slingshot. Oh well. Guess it wouldn't kill you to use the beetle for a while. Now. Now this is where I'm going to have to fast forward because I'm going to try to strike that goddess cube there. Of course, the motion controls are a bit iffy at some point. You always have to recalibrate it. Let's give this another go. Of course, this is being post-commentary. I guess I, I'm going to have to fast forward through there if I miss this again my second time around. Okay. 
like I said, motion controls can be a bit iffy. Yeah, let's give this another go. One more time ought to do it. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna have to fast forward through this part. to agree with that gangster there. It is about fucking time I hit that thing. Right. Okay. Now that we've gotten the goddess cube out of the way, let's keep on moving on. I think. We still got a ways to go, though. Oh, another Octorok. Uh, am I hallucinating or did I did I just see a pokey? Oh well, let's move on, shall we? Okay. Now that we've Yeah, let's well rock I can't talk. Oh my gosh. Let's walk across the uh, sink sand. First let's consult our map. Oh this guy. Oh, not gonna give me a chance to scan this guy, but he will drop rocks on us. Up. Oh. Why are you stopping us, Fi? We're gonna sink. Oh, wait a minute. There's a hidden platform under us. I forgot. I forgot. That robot said there were hidden platforms under the sink sand. Now, if you look at the map carefully, you will see that there are areas on the map usually indicates a some sort of a hidden platform underneath the sand so we can place our markers we got five of them now of course yeah motion controls can be a bit iffy okay those markers definitely come in handy. Yeah, we don't have to worry about sinking there. So, this big control paddle thing, and there's a dead bot there. And there's also some... Okay, let's see. Let's get rid of these piles of rubble there. Now... Aside from that rupee that was under there, there's also a time shift stone there, but we're not going to worry too much about that right now. What we're going to do, though, is try to drop that... Or not. Or not. I'm trying to drop that bomb into that basket there. Ow! That hurt. Oh, boy. Let's try that again. Ah, to hell with it. Let's just have a sit and think this over. Okay. Thought about it. I guess we could just throw that... A throw, yeah, we could throw a bomb from over here. God damn, I can't get a good vantage point. Yeah, I can't think. Come on. Ah, foofy. What a waste of a perfectly good bomb. <sighs> well, let's give this another go. Yeah, let's give it another go. Okay. Right. We can drop down here. And there's an amber relic there. Nothing more over here. Okay, it's sink and sprint from here. <laughs> Ooh, bombs. Nice. 
Mine! 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 Moving on. Moving on. You know, at a certain point, let's see here. Hmm. Okay. Now. Now that X indicates where we have to go. But I'm thinking there should be... There's three things we have to do, and there is a pillar of light up there. I don't know why I planted one there. Yeah, these motion controls leave lit something to be desired. Okay, you know what? You know what? Oh, I did not mean to do that. It's sink or sprint. I've heard of sink, it's sink or swim, but this is too much. Oh, you know what? Let's mosey on over here. There is a crack in the wall over here. Let's blow this thing up. There appears to be some kind of building over here. And with that, we now have a way to get in. Why did I put that marker there? Let's get rid of it. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Now. <laughs> let's, oh, there's a pile of rubble there. Well, that's different then. Right. Oh, nothing under there. Let's go in here. Now. Let us see. There's a lot of ampulluses here. Yeah, that's what those snail things are called. They're called ampulluses. Oh. Of course, they charge us like a bull. And that's no shit. And that's no bullshit. <laughs> yeah. Of course, we already know these guys will disappear after a while. And yes, they will respawn. Kaboom! Mine. Okay, let's... Yeah, let's go bowling for rubble. Quite interesting. I wish they'd added a bowling game in... I wish they'd added a bowling game in Skyward Sword. That would have been something using bombs for bowling. And there is a time shift stone under there too. So, what we have to do, hit the time shift stone and see what happens. Now, as you can see, those ampullas have reverted back to eggs. I guess they take about 50 years or so to pupate. And we, of course, have a few of those. Perfect. Yeah, let's finish this guy off. There's, guys, there's nothing worse than a... <laughs> Yeah, nothing worse than a bunch of techno bacoblins. Especially when they wield like some damn tasers. Ow, oh, shocking. Ow! Oh, you son of a bitch! Well, that takes care of him. Now. Get our sword ready. I think there's another one over there. Yeah, we can knock him out. And finish him off. Now there's an Ampulus egg right here. That we can put in here. Of course, Fi's gonna tell us everything. Okay. 
Right. There's an... Now, we can carry these, but there's too much risk of being electrocuted while we're carrying them. So we're going to use the hooked beetle at this point. But first, we're going to scan this egg. And of course, this is called an ampullus egg. That's right, it's called an ampullus egg. It's an ampullus that is reverted to its earlier form of development. <laughs> nice. These guys are really good. <laughs> you know, before these eggs hatch, they actually do make good batteries. You will see why in just a moment. Okay, looks like we got it. We gotta hurry before we get electrocuted. Now, uh oh. Looks like we're good. Wait, wait for them to stop discharging electricity. Like I said, it's too risky to be carrying these things by hand. We have to basically use. Oh shit. Like I said, even with their just eggs, they can be very dangerous. Anyway, we got the gate open. There should be something quite interesting on the other side. There is this thing here. You'll see what it does in just a moment. Just turn it. I can't. I can't remember. Oh, yeah. Press A when you turn it to the left. Okay. Now, if you turn this, let's talk to this guy. Now, if memory serves me correctly, break these barrels open. If memory serves me correctly, the location of these symbols represents what you have to do with that big thing in the middle of the desert. You'll see why later on. Yeah. That's what I should have done. I should have used the hook beetle to carry those eggs. Let's open this chest. We get some coinage here. And let's mosey on out of here. Oh, forgot about this guy. Let's finish him off. Oh, don't you dare get up. Ah, oh, poofy. Oh, that does it for him. Anyway, moving on. Oh. Don't have any more reason to be in here than we, any more than we need to. Let's get out of here. Oh, you know what? I I could have sworn there were treasure chests in here. Oh well, get out of here. Now, if memory serves me correctly, I think. Oh. There's a tumbleweed. Oh, well, we won't worry about that. Now, if memory serves me correctly, I think... Yeah, if memory serves me correctly. Let's see here. Time to check our map. You know? Yeah. No, not that way. Not that one. Wrong one. Let's see where we're at. Okay, there is a building over there. Now. Okay, and there's one over... Let's see, not there. That's where we came from. Okay. Yeah, let's go after the... Let's go after that one, too. Yeah. Yeah, okay, let's go after that one. Now, there is an elect there's a lightning spew in there too that we have to contend with. So let's be very careful not to sink in the sink sand. Ah, the how did that happen? How the hell did that happen? Right. Let's try that again. And this time, let's try not to sink in the sink sand. We'll not worry about that spume. Let's just mosey on this way. 
Oh, there's... Sh oh, shit, there's another one. Right, let's just get out of here. Moving on. Now, there is definitely something over here. There is another one of those buildings. Now, this one's definitely going to be a big doozy here. Uh-oh. Forgot about those ampelises. Now, let's pull the switch here, and we've created a shortcut. A shortcut back to the beginning of the desert. And there's a save point right there, but we're going to go inside this building here. Okay. Now, this one's going to prove more complicated. Oh, like I said, I haven't played this in a long time. Ah, shit. You see what I do? These guys are a nuisance, especially when they discharge electricity. Oh. Yeah. Those guys are a real nuisance. Uh-oh. Ow. Ow, that's so Let's dispatch this Abtilus. And we can throw a bomb over here. Kaboom. Yeah, kaboom. Mine. Right. It's sink or sprint. <laughs> There's a couple of bacoblins there, too. Ugh, what a pain in the ass. No. Oh, more of them. There was a spy. I failed to read it. Right. Ooh, Ooh bomb. Never have enough bombs. Now, now if memory serves me right, I shit. Ah, Foofy. Now, where was I? Oh yeah. If memory serves me correctly, there is a time shift stone under this pile of rubble. Again, like I said, this is post commentary. So what we have to do is strike this thing. And of course, all the sink sand is gone. The ampulluses revert back to their larvae form. And we've gotten more, got more of those techno to begin with. Leo die already! Ah, shit. I forgot about those eggs. Yeah, I forgot about those eggs. You will die! I hate you with a vengeance! Monies. Ooh, let's see what we have in this chest. Monies! Mine! Moving on. Let us see here. Uh-oh. Oh, my giddy aunt. Now, wasn't there a bacop? Oh, yeah. Okay, we stud this bacop and let's finish him off. Right. Moving on. Every time I shake the remote, the Joy-Cons, <laughs> or, or the remote, <laughs> oh, God, what version you're playing? Every, every time I would shake to do the uh, finishing move, <laughs> my moves would just bounce up and down. Oh shit, I forgot about that Ampilus egg. The, 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 the okay. Now with that Bacoblin deceased, we're good. Ooh, mine. Mine! Moving on. Now, wasn't there something... Hmm. Let's see. There should be something up here. Now, 
Now there should be a way to get up there. Get over there. I could have swore there was a way to get over there. Carry this Ampelus egg over here for now. Now, if memory serves me correctly, I actually have to step on that switch, but here's the dilemma. There is no way to get back over there. Wait. Of course, I have got to try it with the other Ampelus egg. Yeah. At this point, I'm having a total brain fart. Right. It looks like I'm gonna have to find another way to get over there. Yeah. <laughs> and then it occurred to me. If I hit this time shift stone... All the Ampelus eggs will grow up to be fully grown adult Ampeluses. Or Ampeli. Yeah. Like I said, I have not played this game in a long time. It's been like a long time. So, yeah, you know what? You know what? I could actually dispatch one of those Ampeluses and ride their shell, because the sink sand here definitely has a bit of a current. And it appears to be going that away. Yeah, just have to wait for an Ampelus. Just have to look for an Ampelus. Ooh, I, but while I'm over here, I might as well dig for coinage. Ah, Foofy, I was too slow. Well, I wasn't digging for rupees, I was digging for hearts. Well, as long as there's one over here, let's get that one. Let's get back over here, we're yeah, seek or sprint. That's the thing to do here. Seek or sprint. No, there's an Ampelus over here. Come on over and get it. You want a piece of meat? Ah, spooky. Ah! Yeah. Okay. Back to the son of a bitch. Yeah, you know what? Let's wait for that shell to disappear. Let's see if I can sprint across here. I think I can. I think I... No, I can't. Ah, foofy. Ah, foofy. <sighs> like I said, I'm a, I had a massive brain fart. Then it occurred to me. I can dispatch this monstrosity with musk. I can't talk. Yeah, kind of glitched out a little bit. Okay. Did you die already? Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake. Will you die already? Well, okay. let's get on top of the shell. And we'll just ride the current. Yeah, that's right, folks. I should have remembered that. I should have remembered that I could actually ride the current over here. You know, while I'm up here... Oh, oh I forgot about it. Yeah, like I said, while I'm up here, there's a treasure chest here. Let's open it up and see what we have inside. We get... Some ore here. Right. Let's push this thing over here. We have a way now. And as long as I'm over here, I might as well destroy those... Destroy that pile of rubble here. Let's see what we have underneath. Ooh, mine. 
Mine. Mine. Okay, that's mine. That's mine. And we can mosey on back this way. And we can attack that. Yeah. Okay. Let's attack the uh, time shift zone. And we can carry the other Ampelus egg over there. Grab the hook. Yeah, grab the hook beetle and carry this Ampelus egg over this way. Now, what we want to do is get it over here. Bombs away. Now then, let's mosey on back this way. And we can... Yeah, let's mosey on back this way. And let's see what we can do about this stupid Ampelus egg. Power the generator, open the gate. Like I said, even Ampelus eggs could be dangerous. Right. Now let's activate this generator here. Turn the sword to the left using motion controls. I'm not sure how that would work it with button controls. Right. And there is another symbol appearing on the map. Let's open these chests and see what we have inside. Beginning with this big one here. Ooh, we get a monster horn. That's good. That could prove useful in some of our upgrades. And let's open this chest. We get a 20 rupee prize. What was that? Oh, um, I'm just colorblind right now. Right. Let's mosey on back this way. We don't need to be in here any more than we need to. So, let's get through this maze and get the hell out of here. Anyway, moving on. Okay, folks. Now, if we check our map, we could... Yeah, we could check our map at any time. Oh, there is a track here. Oh, I about this oh boy. Now, I'm going to have another brain fart at this point. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have a brain fart at this point. But if you look at the map carefully, one of the symbols... Yeah, actually, you know what? Like I said, I'm having a massive brain fart at this point. What I can do... I can mosey on this way. There's a crack in the wall. I'm really not supposed to be over here yet. Oh boy. I am not supposed to be here yet. But in any way, let's mosey on this way. Let's go through this tunnel. And there are a couple of vagina plants to deal with. Well, actually, there's a, a couple of yellow choo-choos. There's a... I could have sworn there were... No, they weren't vagina plants. They were choo-choos. Now, if memory serves me correctly... Oh, shit. There's a really big one here. And there's a treasure chest here. Let's open it up and see what we have inside. We get a piece of heart. Nice. Now, we can't go this way just yet. We'll have to come back here much later on in the game. Yeah, you made a mistake, Jake. We cannot go this way yet. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, I can't go that way. Yeah. So, I think the best thing to do is sprint over this way. Yeah. Let's see. Now... 
Now to look for the final symbol to activate. Ugh. Now what have we got here? Oh, I forgot about those pillars. I forgot about those light pillars. I planted some light markers there. Ugh. Sometimes it's just not easy playing as an adventurer. Okay. And there's nothing over there. We came from. Okay. I would have to recal. I think I had to recalibrate it. I think. Why am I planning it over here? The marker's not that way. Well, like I said, this is post-commentary, and I had just come from over there, as I remember correctly. Yeah, I had just come back from over there. Okay. Let's see here. All right. I think... Yeah, I think the third symbol is behind there. Right. Time to sink or... Yeah, time to sink or sprint. <laughs> sink or sprint. Okay. With that... Let's see. Ooh, there's a time shift stone. That would make our triple hell of a lot easier. Throw a bomb in the basket. Give it a slam dunk. Okay, let's slam dunk another bomb in here. Oh, Michael Jordan, eat your heart out. Oh. Okay, let's... Activate this last thing here. And we've... Activated all three. Now that that's done, pay close attention to the map. Oh. High five. Uh, high five! <laughs> okay. Right! Uh... Okay. Oh boy. Let's mosey on over here and see about activating this generator. Oh, we still can't do anything about it. Yeah, we can't do anything about it. But then it occurred to me. Is it wasn't there a time shift stone around here? Oh, wait, duh! I should have remembered. There's a time shift stone over here. But first, let's have a sit and think this over. Let's think these over a little bit. Hmm. Wait, isn't that a time shift stone over there, I thought, at first? Yeah, there's definitely a time shift stone here. I should have remembered. Now with the, uh... Oh, more of a goblin. <laughs> oh, man, that does not get old. Okay. Okay, let's have a look at our map. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Alrighty. Okay, let's see. Okay, I'm having a brain fart here. Here. 
What, what am I doing? Oh, duh! Okay, that symbol is over here. So, let's uh, turn this over here. Uh, yeah, Phi has something to say, of course. You gotta remember the, uh... Okay. Let's try this again. Okay, that's one down. Let's turn this over this way. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. There we go. And with that out of the way, we now have a... We have now activated the generator. Which... Of course, it's going to make something really cool happen. There is a big ancient. Looks kind of like a circular. It's not a pyramid. It's more like I don't know what you'd call that. But a building just rose up out of the sink sand, and it's time to go on in and see what we have inside. Do this. Let's do this. Okay, the uh Lanairu mining facility. But we're gonna have to save that for another video. In the next video, we're going to explore more of this mine. But until next time, this has been a walk me through. I'm Mr. O saying peace, and that's a wrap, and I'll see you next time. Peace. This video's over, but if you enjoyed it, click that like button, give me a comment, and if you want to see more, click the subscribe button and ring that notification bell. That way, you'll know when I post more videos. Thanks for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more, you know what to do. Also come and pay my channel a visit. Until next time, peace.